Today's Flash Briefing is brought to you by Power Credit Union, proudly serving Southern Colorado. Visit a location today and be empowered. It's Tuesday, May 26th. I'm Ira Cronin, and this is a News 5 update. In your Capital Watch, restaurants want to hang on to a new service they picked up during the pandemic, selling alcohol to go. And they may get some help from lawmakers. Governor Polis did sign that executive order allowing restaurants to do this for 30 days. But when the legislature reconvenes today, they'll discuss a bill that could extend these to-go sales past the Safer at Home phase. We don't know what the future is going to look like, so um, extending the alcohol to go and delivery allowances for restaurants uh, for a two year period while we're trying to get through this recovery, I think is going to be key to restaurants surviving. The bill itself will still need the leadership in the legislature to sign off because it's being introduced so late in the session. And that's just one of the issues our state lawmakers will be tackling again as they get back to work in person today for the first time since March. One of the biggest tasks they'll be facing approving a new state budget. The COVID-19 pandemic created quite a revenue shortfall of more than $3 billion. All right, let's get a check on your Tuesday forecast now with meteorologist Sam Schreier. It's absolutely great. It's kind of warm out there today. We're going to have those temperatures and the highs get into the mid to upper 70s in Colorado Springs. 80s for most of Highway 50 from Canyon City through Pueblo out east. Pueblo is one of the warmer spots in the forecast today and 70s from Walsenburg out to Trinidad. In the next seven days, here's kind of what we're looking at. The numbers Wednesday, Thursday through the weekend, more rain chances back in the forecast. But we think that tomorrow's rain chance is probably going to wait more so to the afternoon and overnight, or excuse me, the evening and overnight hours. And then, yes, hotter weather over the extended. Pueblo is going to be even hotter over the extended from Friday through the weekend. More storm chances during the day, but tomorrow, while the day looks dry, it looks pretty wet in the evening and overnight hours. Thank you for listening to today's News 5 Flash Briefing, sponsored by Power Credit Union.